as Will Smith rolls up over here on the left side, taking on the real deal, mixed deal. I still think my idea was better. Well, Joe Costello and Brian Lones kind of convinced Mick that he needed to be the real deal mixed steel, so he had T-shirts made and decals made for the real deal. My idea was I'm better than aluminum mixed steel. I might, might not roll off the tongue as easy, but I think it'd look awesome on a T-shirt. Blanket comes off the front of the Robin Samsel owned Will Smith driven machine as they crank him to life. Am I the only one that misses Mike Gunnerson's old classic alcohol tank on the back that was a Coors Light can? <laughs> it just seemed perfect. So there's your bump spot, 10.97 seconds. How does it feel to know that if you have a super street car, you could qualify for alcohol dragster right now? You, you, you're not going to be able to by the time we're all said and done, but for right now. So here comes mixed deal. Like that car, really pops, really stands out from the crowd with the neon orange and black. Here comes Will Smith. Lucas and NGK first met Will Smith, what's it been now, a few years ago. When I was headed out to Indy in the PRI show, and he came up, introduced himself, handed me a business card. He said, I'm going to be racing an injected nitro car before the end of the year. Said, okay. Whoa, where's he going? Man, look at Will Smith back. Will Smith looks like my mom at the boat ramp. I mean, I love my mother dearly, but she could not back up a boat trailer. We'll see if he can get that thing over in the spot where he wanted it. Man, he was really swinging that thing back and forth. Looks like they've got her pointed in the right direction now and hopefully in the spot they want on the track. Meanwhile, Mick, or Mick and Rick, kind of standing over there on the other side going, you get, you guys ready yet? There's the nod from one side to the other. And hopefully Will Smith's car goes a whole lot straighter going that way than it was doing coming this way. I just got called mean up here. If you've ever seen my mom at the boat ramp, that wasn't mean. Smith took the tire off of the step, 565, 265 for Mick Steele. I think just kind of labored its way down there. I mean, a decent run, but certainly not what they were looking for. You can always tell the body language of the crew when they're walking off the start line if they're pleased with that. And Mick's car didn't exactly snap on the tire. I might want to be rethinking my, uh, my bump prediction here. Yeah, my 22's not looking so good. No. I'm not giving up yet, though. We still got two good qualifying sessions.